now. This is old. Hey, you been seeing a city girl? Yep. She wants me to go up to Auckland with her. Oh, yeah? What's the attraction up there? Place in the harbour. 500 SL Mercedes. 80-foot yacht. And old man's got a box at Eden Park. Oh, yeah. She doesn't drink spades, but... She's a hard row finding the perfect woman, boy. Reckon. Still. No hurry, eh? Good on you, mate. Spades. Pride of the South for over a hundred years. Where's that guy? Nowhere. Well, anywhere north of here is nowhere. And that? That goes back home, son. I hear they're sending train loads of spades up north these days. Pride of the South for over a hundred years. Good of Wally to let his mates take a memento. Generous to a fault, Wally. Bit of oddity by all accounts. That right? See that shed? Wally once told me. He's got near on a hundred dozen spades locked up in there. Same, but. She's one of life's tragedies, boy. What's that you got? A pot. Oh, yeah. I thought Wally would have wanted us to have it. Good on you, mate. Spades, pride of the South for over a hundred years. What's going on here then? Mrs. reckons it's high time we move to a warmer climate. That right. Yep. Off of the bar in New Swanee, you know. Always the gentleman. Oh, well. She's gone. And she's taken two-thirds of the business. Sounds like she's left you with the short end of the stick. No, no, son. The sharp end of the building. Good on you, mate. Spades, pride of the South for over a hundred years. Spade celebrates 125 years of brewing the pride of the South. Good on you. My. Lucky last. If you can call being a sheep lucky. Must be your turn, I reckon. Getting too long in the tooth to start playing mountain goat, boy. Tell you what, get this one and you can have the last can of spades. <laughs> you can call me old, boy. You can't call me stupid. Good on you, mate. 
Spades. Pride of the South for over a hundred years. Well, that's that. Let's continue with the tour. Come on this way, folks. You're looking at the eighth wonder of the world, boy. And probably the ninth. I reckon. Inside this, you feel humbled by your own insignificance. Tour's gone, door's locked. She doesn't open until Monday. We're trapped. Some might say that, boy. Some might just say, thank you. I suppose you better call for help. Help? Don't know about you, but all this yelling's left me fair parched. Shall we? Good on you, mate. Spites. Pride of the South for over 125 years. This could be the start of a whole new adventure, boy. I reckon. You going to the Deerstalkers Ball this year? Hadn't planned on it. I've got a live band. Spot prizes. Mrs McConnell's making a venison pie for the supper. Oh, yeah. They've got spates on tap all night and a late license. She makes a fair game pie, does Mrs. McConnell. That right. I've got two tickets. Tell you what, it's on me. Fair enough. Might see you there then. Pride of the South for over 125 years. Good sport there, Sharon. Generous to a fault, boy. More pie. Yeah. Top of Simpsons Ridge. Yeah, right, Oak. What you got there? Cell phone. Comes in handy sometimes. Yeah, yeah. I'm not one to stand in the path of progress, boy, but it'd take a hard night's argument to convince me of that. And it'd be a dry one. You the blokes called for the spates? Progress. You would have been quicker on us. Good on you, mate. Spites. Pride of the South for over 125 years. Busy day? Don't ask. Got a hell of a job finding a park for the Beamer. <laughs> Still happy hours, Sharon? For you, boys. Anytime. A little easier on the salt with this one, Shares. See amalgamated smeltings down four points. I did warn you. How's Susan? Marvellous. New tennis coach, and a new Merc. Mind you, the Audi did have 1500 on the clock. No. Thanks, darling. Have one yourself. How's that horse of yours? One it's last started, Trentham. Oh, well done. Well, chin chin. Is that a new hat? Yeah, Susan chose it. I think it works, don't you? <laughs> You're right. It's times like this you appreciate your own place in the eternally spiraling cosmos, boy. Spites. Pride of the South for over 125 years. Spites. Not a new hat, is it, boy? No. Good on you, mate. 